Hi everybody. Uh, I'm here today to talk about Siri on the iPhone 4. Uh, something that for whatever reason Apple does not want to put Siri on the iPhone 4. They incorporate it into the new iPhone 4S which happens to be phenomenal but I just think that uh, you know for uh, marketing purposes they obviously didn't want to give it to the iPhone 4 because then nobody would have possibly upgraded. Um, the model number, as you can see at the bottom, is an MC319LL, which is an iPhone 4, 32 gigabyte. Here we go. Siri, what's the weather like tomorrow? Here's the forecast. Maybe not so nice tomorrow. Is it going to snow tomorrow? It sure looks like snow tomorrow. Search Wikipedia for Abraham Lincoln. Searching for Abraham Lincoln. How many calories are there in a bagel? Let me check that for you. This might answer your question. Now, as far as this is concerned, um, I've added another hack which gives more Siri functionality. I can turn certain things on and off and change certain things, for instance, if I hit this, I'm going to tell it to enable Wi-Fi. Enable Wi-Fi. Enabling Wi-Fi. Disable Wi-Fi. Disabling Wi-Fi. Set timer for one minute. Setting the timer. Okay, your timer is set for one minute. And obviously you can see, I'll pause the video. The time it said to me, couldn't get the information, but maybe it was busy, it was late at night. Maybe a lot of people were using it. Um, as you could see, the timer is working and we got about five seconds left and then of course it's going to do its thing Oops. and there we go time and done set reminder at 8 p.m. to wake me up your reminder for today at 8 p.m. Shall I create it? Confirm. Open Safari. So Safari obviously you can see has been open. Open Soundhound. Search for vegetarian pasta recipes. Searching the web for vegetarian pasta recipes. In conclusion, I just want to say that uh, if you decide to jailbreak and put Spire on and put it, set it to a proxy server, you know, do it at your own risk. Uh, obviously, I was willing to take the chance. Uh, the thing that only bugs me is that I don't think Apple was truthful in coming out 
supposedly in saying that uh, Siri didn't work, you know, on the iPhone 4 in their field study. Um, I guess they have their own reasoning for saying it. Obviously, you draw your own conclusions. You saw how it works. Uh, I think it's working just as well as I've seen it work on the iPhone 4S. And uh, leave comments. Thank you.